the girl from Pinterest. And today I'm gonna be trying on all of my dresses. Nobody asked me to do this. I just randomly want to do this. I also haven't worn a lot of dresses recently. So I kind of forgot what I have and I just want to try everything on. So maybe I can find something that inspired me to wear dresses again. So I'm gonna do my mini dresses first. These are all of them. And then I'm gonna do my midi and maxi dresses as well. I also have a lot. I'm just gonna show you guys all of my dresses and continue the series that I did half a year ago. After this, I'll probably do matching sets, so stay tuned for that. Follow me on Instagram, um, like and subscribe. Also, there's gonna be a lot of dresses and the last time that I try on all of my tops, I keep saying that everything is cute for like a hundred times. I don't have a lot of adjectives and I find all of my clothes cute, which is why I got them. So I think to make this more interesting, I'm gonna rate my dresses on a scale of 1 to 10. Alright, let's get into the dresses. And of course, I'm gonna do everything by color. And we're gonna start with the little black dresses because, of course, of course. I'm wearing the first one. This is from IMGia. It has a lot of cutouts, which I love. It's pretty thin, but I really like this fabric. It's stretchy. I love anything that's stretchy and comfortable. I would rate this 8 out of 10. I really like it, but I've worn this out a couple of times and I noticed that when I move around a lot, the dress does bunch up like here and create this kind of weird flappy part so I constantly have to adjust it. I don't mind that too much because I pretty much have to do it with all of my dresses because they're all so short but just something to note there. Okay this dress I think I'm gonna give it a seven. It has this tie at the back and this whole string system so you can really adjust it. I just don't reach for this dress a lot because it's so annoying to put it on. It took me like 10 minutes to figure out how to put this on. You can also like adjust this part. I do like the waistline to go down a little bit. Creates like an effect. Let me tie this. But yeah, this part is rouge. It's black so I don't think you can see it really well through the screen. Oh my god, I literally cannot take this dress off. I'm like really trying. I think I'm gonna give it like a 6.5 out of 10 just for this. Like, hello? Imagine you're going out, you get home, you're like drunk as fuck. And then you have to try to take this dress off before you could go to bed. Like, no thanks. Okay, this dress. It looks like a trash bag on me right now, but I've seen this looking amazing on other people. I think it's just too big for me. If it fits right, it could be really amazing. Let me show you what I mean. Imagine if it was like this. This looks so cute, right? I really like the back too, it's backless and they have like these straps so you could cinch the waist. So I'm gonna give this like a four out of 10 because I've had this for two or three years now. Every time I put it on, I would do this. And then I'm like, oh my God, it's so cute. Like I could really wear this, but I've never worn it because, okay. Hmm. I'm gonna give this a six or maybe a five. It's cute, there's nothing wrong with it. I like the fabric, it's ripped, it's stretchy. I just think that this is a little bit boring. The cutout is not doing it for me. It's like a really tame cutout for me. It just looked a little bit boring. I don't know where to wear this too. Because usually I only wear black dresses if I'm going out at night. And I just wouldn't pick this in my closet. I don't know. I have like no feelings towards this. I wish it was more cinched. That's the main thing. Like if it was like this. Um, we love a backless dress. I'm gonna give this 8 out of 10 or maybe 7.5 just because this part right here does look kind of weird sometimes depend on my movement. I don't know if you can see it through the camera, but there's always like this little piece of fabric here flapping in the wind. Other than that, I love the rest. Oh, you can see it here this fabric. But I love the sleeve length. You know how I feel about my sleeves. Really, really love this. I would have rated this dress way higher if it doesn't have this. 
Okay, next. This is quite cute. I thrifted this dress. It could be a little bit more cinch. I know I'm gonna be so annoying about this, but I want all of my clothes to be super snatched and tight fitting. If I wear anything baggy around here, it just emphasizes how skinny I am, and I personally don't like that. I'm gonna give this. 8 out of 10. Okay, this one, I just have a problem with this fit over here. Like this thing is kind of awkward. I don't know how to make it even. And I constantly have to fix this part, but it doesn't want to stay. Also don't like the shape of this belly cutout. It's not that flattering. The length is kind of awkward. It's just the whole proportion of this dress is kind of weird. It's kind of similar to all of my other black dresses, but not as good. So I would reach for some other ones in my closet rather than this. 5 out of 10. Not really my style right now, but I do think it's a really cute dress. I love the color and the contrast details. This cut is also really cute. Again, I wish it was a little bit more singe, but... Ow! Oh my god! Oh my god, I just did something to my toenail. Holy shit! Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm not gonna show you, but I just somehow like kicked into my pinky toe and my toenail is like off. It's hanging on by just the tip and it's not on my nails. Oh my fucking god. I'm like not kidding. I just don't want to show you my feet, but it's it's not bleeding. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I, I don't want to talk about this. Okay, let's forget about all of that and get back to the video. I have to film this. Just, I'm gonna give this a 7.5. I fucking love this. Sleeve length check, perfect. Love this little detail here. Love that it's rouge at the side. I think it's just so cute. I'm gonna give this a 9 out of 10. I don't have anything bad to say about it. But also I haven't rated anything 10 out of 10 yet. Am I like too harsh? Am I being too harsh on my dresses? Okay, this dress, I'm trying to put it on to show you, but I might have to show you a photo of me wearing it because I cannot, I don't have the arm strength to deal with this right now. Okay, this is my Praise Workshop dress that I absolutely love, but it's just the most difficult dress to put on ever, I think in my entire closet. This is like one of the hardest, if not the hardest to put on and even harder to take off. I don't know if you can see, but the fabric is so thick and it's also not that stretchy. There's no zipper to put this on. You have to use like all of your arm strength. And the last couple of times that I wore this, I need my boyfriend to help me put it on and off because I could not do it myself. So I can't can't even imagine if you're like living alone and try to put this dress on. I don't know if my arms are just really weak. It could be. I cannot put this on and take this off myself. But I still really love this. I just like I want to give it like an 8 and above just for the design. But it's just hell to put this on. So maybe I'll give this like a 7. I don't know. If you have this dress, please tell me your experience with this. Because I can't be the only one. Like it's ridiculous. This dress from IMG. This is from a while ago. I think it was 3 years ago. And back then they didn't have my size. It's a little bit too big for me as you can see here. I don't have the boobs to fill this bit. It's actually denim. Looks amazing on the top. I really love it. I just wish the bottom was a little bit shorter. Maybe like to here. I think it would be really cute like this. It's just a little bit too long for my taste. The dress is wearing me, not me wearing the dress, you know what I mean? I feel like I'm just lost in between all of this. Yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna give this like a six. All right, let's move on to the pink dresses. Absolutely love this. I actually wore this for the intro of my first YouTube video. I love the color block here. It's giving me Barbie vibes. I don't have anything bad to say about this. I'm gonna give this eight out of 10. 10 out of 10. I just love how it fits me. This is one of the dresses I have that literally fits me perfectly around here. I have a soft spot for stuff that fits my waist without needing to be adjusted or clipped in the back. I also love the pink color, love the halter. I just think it's so fucking cute. I'm gonna give this maybe a 9 out of 10. How many times have I said the word cute already? 
Now this dress, super adorable. I just love the fuzzy fabric. It's so cute. It goes so well with this pink color. One complaint I have about this is I wore this out once. Um, that day I did have to walk a lot. I kind of walked around the city with my friends. And this dress, just want to expose your ass to the world. I constantly have to keep pulling it down, which is really annoying. It's still very cute. I'm going to give this maybe 6.5. This is giving me Kim K vibes with all of this detail going on. I think it's a cute dress. I'm not sure if it's my style right now. I got this two years ago, I think. It's also a little bit too long. It's kind of like a midi dress. I'm gonna give this maybe five. I feel like if it was this length, I would like it more. Not the most flattering dress. The cut is just weird. The length is also weird. If it was like this, then it would be so cute right i don't think this dress fit me that well it kind of made me look like what is this i would give it a four wow i've had this dress for so long like when i put on a dress that fits me well it's just a whole different vibe love the zebra print love the tiny straps it's oh my god it's kind of emphasizing my armpits a little bit it does fit me really really well really like this i'm gonna give this maybe a seven Okay, this dress and this print really takes me back to 2018. Love the strap. This is like so cute. The dress is cute too. It could be a little bit more snatch. Of course, I feel like I'm just repeating myself saying this, but this is big criteria when it comes to dresses for me. So it's kind of important. It's fine. I'll give it like a six. Okay, this dress. I want to love it so much, but this is a backless dress. And if you wear it out and do a lot of movement, you can see this weird flapping around here and I just I don't know if I can blame the dress because I run into this issue a lot my dog is barking so loudly outside I feel like if they just cut the fabric in a little bit this wouldn't happen okay so this is a lingerie dress obviously this is not the best underwear option it's just what I'm wearing right now but it fits well you know I'm gonna give it like a 7 out of 10 just because it's not like my favorite pieces in my closet or anything so I actually wore this dress on Halloween maybe three years ago. Just like a last minute fairy look. And I really love wearing this dress out. So comfortable. I love the length. It's actually short enough. I'm gonna give this 7.5. Or maybe even eight. This one, I absolutely love the fabric. I love the iridescent. However, I don't really care for the fit of it. It's just a little bit awkward. The length is a little bit longer than I like. I know. I also feel like the fit here is not the best. There's just something slightly off about it. And it's kind of scratchy. Um, All of the seam here is kind of stabby. So it's just kind of uncomfortable. Maybe this fabric is just a little bit hard to work with. I'm gonna give this 7 out of 10. I thought I would give it a lower rating, but now that I have it on, it's kind of cute. I actually have never worn this dress out. You can see all the details here. It's so cute. I love the gold sparkles. I just don't know if this color is really my color. I know I wear every color, but I just feel like this makes my skin tone a little bit weird. But other than that, yeah, no complaint about the fit. I actually really like it. And it's quite... Sorry, I'm just like scratching my armpits. It's like really itchy. Even though there's no zipper and this dress is pretty tight it was easier to put on than i thought so i'm gonna give it that point maybe seven out of ten i kind of really hate this i don't remember this dress being this long like what is this this is like such an awkward length i'm gonna give this like a five it's just not my style right now it would be so cute if it was like this this is from Bamba Swim and when I saw this dress on Instagram, I was just like, this is the dress of my dream. It looks like the sunset. It has all the colors that I love. It's knitted, it's backless. I seriously thought that this was gonna be like my favorite dress, but the fit, just a little bit loose here. If I could get it fixed to be like this, I'm gonna give this maybe a six. 
9 out of 10. This is one of my favorite dresses that I own. I just love a good ombre. I love a sunset color palette. Love a red dress. Okay, I just moved the camera out a little bit so I can be closer to the window. It's been really dark lately. Um, but this dress, it's like a lingerie dress and of course it doesn't fit me right. Like, why are none of my dresses fit me? It could have been so cute. I'm gonna give this like a 6 out of 10 just because it's not the greatest quality or anything. I do want a simple red mini dress but this is not it it's kind of thin but it's not intentionally supposed to be this sheer this one the concept is cute the design logo is cute but execution not so much like why are the sleeves so long i'm confused why and if you like bunch it up it looks kind of weird around here i don't like how the shoulders are cut it could be so cute if it was just better quality. I'm gonna give this maybe a 6. Another one that I really like the design. The print is so cute. I love the watercolor flowers. It comes with a dress underneath so you can wear this if you want. The fit is not great. I think the sleeves are too big for me. I just don't feel the most confident in it. I may give this 6.5. It's a good summer dress. I probably won't wear it with the dress underneath but I appreciate that anyways. This dress I wore in my theme suggestion video but yeah I love this dress. I love the material, the color, the fit is amazing as you can see here. Literally no complaints. It feels really comfortable. There's a zipper. It's easy to put on and take off. Love the neckline. Seriously? Obsessed. 10 out of 10. This is cute. I definitely need to wear it more. Love the rib material. I think it's pretty comfortable. I just don't really care for this neckline. But other than that, this dress is fine. I don't have that many complaints or anything to say about it. I think it's a solid seven. This is a cover-up dress. It doesn't fit me that well. I need to get it tailored, cinch it in a little bit, then it would look so cute. I have this in two colors, white and this green. Yeah, I think I'm gonna give this six out of 10. I would rate it higher if it actually fits me. <sighs> I'm not feeling my hair today, but absolutely love this dress. It's definitely one of my favorites. It makes me feel so dainty and cute. Just love the square neckline. They are my favorite neckline. I love that it's simple. It's a good day dress. I'm gonna give this 9 out of 10. I really hate this color. I got this dress maybe three, four years ago. It's fine. It just wouldn't be something that I picked out right now. I'm gonna give this 7 out of 10. Okay, this dress have like the weirdest fit. The length is awkward. It's not short enough but it's also not long the material is also really bad it fits so weird this part is so big for no reason and it's so scratchy like i'm so itchy right now i'm gonna show you like the inside it's really tight around this area like i can't move it around but then it's kind of loose down here i'm gonna give this like a three it's like the worst fit material combo ever this one i got during 2020 when everyone was like obsessed with tie-dye i was too i think i got like so many tie-dye dresses and sweats at that time and when i look back now i hate most of the tie-dye stuff that i get except for this dress i just really love this color combination and i think tie-dye on like a strappy dress like this is so cute. I still really like this dress and it fits amazing. It's so comfortable, so stretchy. I love the material and I still really love this tie-dye. I would still wear it out, so I'm gonna give this 8 out of 10. Now this dress, okay, I mean look at it. I feel like a princess. Um, I love everything about this dress. I'm gonna give it 9 out of 10. But where do you wear this to? I feel like there's no way you can wear this to. A garden picnic in the summer? I don't know, but I need to have it in my closet. This is a vintage swim dress that I totally should wear more. I don't know why I forgot about this dress. This is like a short little dress. I think it's so cute. I'm gonna give this 7 out of 10 just because once I get it fixed, I feel like it could really be an 8, you know? Do you guys remember when this print was everywhere? I still think it's really cute, it's just not my style right now and quality is not the most amazing. It's kind of like a swimsuit material, kind of shiny. I feel like I would have rated this higher a couple years ago, but 
it's like a five it's quite cute i've actually had this for four or five years now and i've never worn it i don't know i feel like when i got this i really liked the print remember when these flames were like everywhere when i got this i liked the print but i wasn't ready for this type of dress i wasn't like as bold as i am now with sheer tops with no bra underneath and back then i didn't know like what i could have worn underneath this i didn't have that many swimsuits either and now i love the style of the dress i'm just not too sure about this print i feel like this is still really cute i'm gonna give this 7 out of 10. I literally still have like the tag on here because I haven't worn it. Forgot about this dress, but it's so cute. Fits perfectly. I think I got this because I saw Kendall Jenner wore this. The quality is great. I like it a lot. 7.5. I'm running out of things to say about my very similar dresses. This is like the exact same dress as the blue one that I've tried before. So I don't remember how I rated that one. I would rate this half a point lower just because i don't think the print is that cute i definitely prefer the solid one but the fit is really nice um 6.5 okay i'm really tired after trying on a billion dresses and i counted i still have 18 dresses to go so i think i'm gonna try and go really fast with my ratings for these dresses this one 8 out of 10 i definitely should wear it more these types of tops makes my boobs look like this more than it actually is like it's not usually like this you know um so that's why i give it an 8 out of 10 literally cannot breathe in this dress but it's cute it's very different from the rest of my dresses i don't have any other denim dress i'm gonna give this 8 out of 10. i got this dress because i love the print but the fabric that they use for this dress i never hate anything more it's just why is it so wrinkly it would fit so much better like this it looks fine on camera but it actually looks really sloppy in real life probably give this dress a two i don't know it's just like the worst fit ever I am a sucker for any dress that makes me feel like a princess. I love, love, love this layer that I put under. It just makes this dress feel so... I don't know. It's just so cute. 8 out of 10. Mm, I don't know why I got this dress. Nothing about it. It's my style. I don't really care for polka dots. I don't know why I got this. I think I didn't have that many backless dress at that time. And I like that it was backless. But this is so not me. I think I'm gonna give this like a 6. It has like some elements that I like in clothing. But overall, the whole dress is just not me. This dress is also not usually my style. But I really love this one. The fabric feel amazing it's just so flowy when i got this i wasn't sure if i would like it i just want to experiment but i end up really loving this 8 out of 10 mm. i do love the giant cutout here i'm just not really a fan of this pattern anymore i think at that time they had a black version of this i don't know why i didn't get it i think i wasn't really into black so i always picked colors instead and i definitely regret some of my decisions back then because the black version i feel would have been more timeless and i would want to wear it more now this is like six um i don't know why i got this this is giving me mom vibe flat the fit the length 2 out of 10 i don't know i want to take this off this is quite cute love the knit material i think i just don't reach for this a lot because again it's a little bit big on me but i just love this knit so much i definitely need to get this tailored along with 70 other dresses that i have right now because it's so big on me i feel like you can't really see the pattern but once it's smaller and more stretched out i feel like it would look really cute i'm having like the worst hair day of my life right now you know what i mean like it would look so cute like this um six out of ten um this dress i love it i think it's really cute i like the color my only complaint is that it's supposed to come with like a pair of thong that is the same purple color so it would match the dress i don't know why it didn't send to me it was supposed to come like with the dress in the same packaging but yeah other than that the dress is fine i it's like a seven i think it's cute i do want to wear it sometimes 
maybe I'll have to go and buy the thong online so I can wear this dress. It's kind of annoying though. This is the same dress as the black one that I tried before. I actually have a white one as well. So I have them in three colors. I'm probably not gonna try this one on. I'm gonna give it like the same rating as the black one. Same with this because they are identical except for the colors and they share the same problem. So they're all equally the same to me. Do I wanna rate this color higher? I really love the purple. Okay, this dress was seriously a nightmare to put on, <laughs> but it looks so cute. But anyways, I could not put it on myself. I literally have to go and ask my boyfriend to help me pull this down. And it was like a whole mission. As you can see, it's so tight and it fits really well. It's so cute. I love the color and everything. Look at this little butterfly that is on it. But there's like no zipper. It's not that stretchy either. It's seriously, I'm still catching my breath from trying to pull this on. I I wish I could wear this dress a lot more but every time I think about having to put it on I'm just scared like I'm terrified I was so dreading having to put this dress on because now I can't take it off myself either like a dress shouldn't be this much work like if there's a zipper and this was easy to put on I could easily give this dress a 9 10 I'm gonna give this maybe a 7 or a 6 oh my god this dress I've had since 2016 it's been forever. Do you guys remember back in 2016 that picture of Paris Hilton in her 21st birthday dress went viral? This dress was recreated everywhere but this is from Almighty. I wanted this so badly. Also a little bit, not a little bit, too big on me. This is just taking me back. There's just so many memories attached to this. But honestly right now I'm gonna give this maybe 5, 4 out of 10 just because it's kind of scratchy. It's not the most amazing quality dress. This I also got a while ago. I can't tell if it's cute or not. I wore this out on like a New Year's Eve party. I love the flower detail here. It's just the fabric is really scratchy. It's really stabbing me right now. I think this is for going on raves and stuff, but I don't know. It's just not the most comfortable dress. Six out of 10. I don't remember this dress being this long. Like I swear it was a mini dress. I actually wore this to a wedding once and that was like before I found out that you can't wear white at weddings because it's more like a western tradition than here now that I know I kind of get it because the bride should be the only one in white I don't know I didn't know back then and I wore this to my friend's wedding I don't like the fit of it it's kind of uncomfortable um I'm gonna give this like a six I don't know if you can see all these rhinestones that are on it. It looks super sparkly in real life. I don't know if you can see on camera, but another sparkly dress. I actually really love this dress. I would get it altered so it would be shorter. So this is like a sheer layer with stones and then a kind of like metallic-y leopard print underneath. I think the combination gives it kind of like a wet look. It's giving me mermaid vibes. I feel like it would be so cute to wear on vacation to the beach. After I get this tailored if it fits like this I would give it 8 out of 10 but since it's kind of awkward I'm gonna give this a 7 okay I wish you guys can see this dress in real life because the camera doesn't do it justice it's so sparkly in real life like it's actually insane I don't know how to show you on camera but it's completely sheer it's covered in these stones that reflect different colors it's just so good i just got this dress like not too long ago and i haven't found somewhere that i can wear this to yet and i really want to wear it soon maybe to the beach i don't know everything that i get i just want to wear it to the beach maybe with a bikini underneath nine out of ten just because of the material it looks so good from the back like hello okay we made it this is the last dress or the last two dresses basically i have the exact same one in pink so i don't want to try it on it looks exactly the same just pink and my rating for this will be the same as this this dress 
is so hot i mean i do wish that this was a bit shorter i know i'm so annoying with this because i think this dress is supposed to be low waist but when you pull this down i feel like this is kind of awkwardly long i would prefer it to be this short i'm gonna give this a nine and that's all of our mini dresses now i have to go and hang all of my dresses back which will take me a couple hours thank you so much for watching this video stay tuned for part two where i try on my midi and maxi dresses as usual let me know what your favorite pieces are if you have the same ratings as mine for the dresses don't forget to like this video it would really help the channel and subscribe if you want to see more from me i'm gonna go eat something and i'll see you in the next video <laughs>